the Joe Rogan experience. The best thing is to get into the state we could just be Doug Stanhope. And I go, Doug Stanhope, you're on. And just push you onto the stage. And, and to get me into that state, I have to know Incorrect. what time I should Incorrect. not be no. shit faced like no, I was no, no, last no, no, night. No, 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 no. This, this is the way. Don't take 50 Cheers. milligrams. Come on. Take don't, 175. Don't, don't take 50 milligrams and then have Joe Rogan go, Show starts now. Let's oh, do fuck. mushrooms. Let's do mushrooms. Let's do. Oh, I'm scared the show of them. On I'm scared me of them. Me too. That's the point. Come on. How Douglas. long has it been? I did, Yesterday. I, I did do. Uh, I for micro me. Dosed. I, uh, I'm doing them all the time. All right. Small amounts. I don't like it. exactly. Uh, I don't want to even say her name, but yeah, Shh. Carmen Morales. What? Yeah, she came out. She What's was her name. Don't say her name. She's a comic. Don't. Listen to me. I, you I, don't want to say her name. Don't say her name. I, Let's I, call her. She would want Boogie her name Woogie. to be said. No, it was it, no. She wasn't dealing. She's drugs. She's giving you drugs. Yeah. Don't. You've given me drugs. Shh. <laughs> don't tell these fucking people. Can you black out the Joe Rogan experience and just say the experience? Doug Stanhope. Allegedly. Doug Stanhope. When uh, I the first time he and I uh, did DMT. I was worried I lost him. I was really genuinely worried. Oh my goodness. You were gone. Oh my goodness. You had, you had gone oh my like goodness. you had gone through this snoring thing where I was I was like, do I lift him up so that he doesn't swallow his fucking tongue? I was like, oh my god, if I kill Doug, if the man show dies, because I give Doug DMT. It was it was dying, by the way. That we knew we were writing the last monologues <laughs> ever. And that's what fucked me up. I'm we've told this story every time, I'm sure, oh. on your podcast. But we were at your house writing we know this is the last of the monologues and they're fucking just pap dredge fucking awful. Uh What's up, it guys? It wasn't that bad. But by the end, it wasn't that when bad. we it know it's just, fucking over was, and we're beaten. Yeah, w th well, there was some... Last some... time you want to smoke DMT, <laughs> my first time, like, all right, this sucks, and we're just getting through this, and then you <laughs> you want to smoke DMT, and then I go fucking into yeah. alternate realities, and then I come out of it 10 minutes later saying, I remember, I, I came out of it just saying, oh, my goodness, oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness, because I've just learned the fucking... You know what else you said? You said, you've already seen this. <laughs> you said that to me. Oh, you've already seen this. You've already I seen this. I swear the picture of fucking Bill Hicks on your wall winked at me, and when I yeah. said that to the you... The one with him and the, the lighting the American flag with a cigarette. Well, yeah. What, you had a, lighting uh, the uh, cigarette with the American flag. But I, yeah. I came out of it, and I looked, and I swear Bill Hicks fucking winked at me. When I said that to you, you went, uh, fucking... Looked at me like cliche <laughs> but I, like, I swear that happened no. i'm not even that big a bill no. hicks fan you were just you were just insecure because you had like experienced death and you came back when we would go, when i would go outside to smoke cigarettes from the writer's room on the lot after that yeah. for a week i couldn't make direct eye contact with the giant dumpster size electrical generator because <laughs> i thought i could make it blow up with my mind the wiring in my head <laughs> was so I've never done it since. People try oh, to drop should, that off at the merch booth. I we go, should do it never tonight. again. We should do it tonight. <laughs> Fuck no. Yeah, come well, on. Yeah, man. when I'm when I'm about okay. to when You're I'm going to quit smoking cigarettes. You're yeah, better now be. because of that day. I don't know. Yeah, you are. You know why? Because you know that that's possible. You didn't know that that was possible. But it's hard to break up. Okay, I'm going to write a bit about this. That now I know is dog shit and means nothing because I've been through that experience. Where you go, this is all so fucking, life is so silly, but you still have to make yeah, a living by- but Doug, just express that. You don't have- I've been doing that. But I know you have, but don't worry about that. It doesn't have to be dog shit and silly. It's you, you don't think about that. Think about you. Think about if you were like some 24-year-old guy working in a fucking- newspaper distributor office you had a bullshit job and you're allowed to listen to podcasts and you listen to you talk about your experience don't worry about like <coughs> your own fucking weirdness in in handling it worry about what it is what it is is like you died and came back like you really felt like you died and came back when you came back i, you, I you, didn't you feel like i died you said I to felt me like i let me, knew let me, let me you said to me here say your honor this is what you said you said life eats life. You said life just eats life. Life eats life. 
Life eats life. Wow. This is what you said. When you were coming out, you were like, life just eats life. Life just eats life. It just keeps going. It keeps going. Life eats life. Life eats life. I'm just trying wow. to hang on. Life eats life. Life eats life. It's like, you've already been there. You've already been here. You've already been here. Ultimate knowledge. And then knowledge. you're like, you took, you took me to this place. You've already been there. I'll never forget that. Because I thought you were going to die. And I was like, God damn it. Nobody's ever died from this shit. I'm like, if Doug's the first guy to die, <laughs> I'm like, he's... Like maybe I like overestimated the RPMs that his fucking engine can handle and redlined, <laughs> but you you got through it. And that was the the thing you kept saying: life eats life, life eats life, life eats life. But but life the, life. the 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 dichotomy of having to go from that supernatural experience yeah. in ten minutes and then go back to oh wait now we really have to try it finishing up these dumb monologues yeah but that's okay like, too ah. that's okay too because that's a unique challenge that's like this, some weird thing we're doing like what are we doing